UBS ordered to pay a record $5.1 billion fine. The bank found guilty by a French court of money laundering. There are now five convicted UBS ex-bankers as well. Joining us now for more, Allison Williams, Bloomberg Intelligence, a senior banks analyst. UBS not going quietly into the night with this, pushing back. Walk us through what we know. So uh, there was a settlement today. We did expect that there, uh, excuse me, there, there was a fine to announced today. We did expect an announcement today. Um, we didn't necessarily expect that it would go in this direction. Um, so it is a sizable fine uh, and could be a headwind. But again, the company has come out. They've said that they're going to appeal this. So to the extent that there is a cost to UBS and a hit to their capital, we're talking months or several years, and it could be dramatically reduced. Uh, is there any sort of silver lining here in that this has been going on for years? Does this sort of get rid of any clouds that we might have had over UBS? To the extent that uh, they can get these legal issues behind them, obviously that, that is a positive, but there's, a, there's always the trade-off between the ultimate cost and the certainty. So we've seen a similar um, thing happening with the Department of Justice case. As you know, all the major U.S. banks have gotten this behind them now. Deutsche Bank and Credit Suisse has gotten that behind mm -hmm. them. For UBS, it's a little <coughs> bit outstanding, right. so there could be a potential $2 billion right. hit there as right. well.